Hey, how are you? Andy from Blue Collar Corner. What do you do for a living, uh, man? I'm a carpet performer. And where do you work? I work uh, for a company called Nastasia and & Associate, and uh, we're currently doing a uh, high-rise apartment building in the city, 5th Avenue and 36th Street. Mostly commercial construction the company does? Yes. Okay, I hear a lot of bad news about commercial construction for next year. Do you hear the same? Yeah. Uh, 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 word on the street is that uh, things are slow and uh, union issues with a lot of non-union work coming into the city uh, is a problem. So uh, with those two elements there, it, it's going to be a, a rough go. Now, our, our field is getting slammed as far as uh, layoffs and uh, finding work. What do you think? Uh, do you think the government's doing the right thing by uh, utilizing all the stimulus money and TARP money? Do you think it'd be used for better things than uh, just putting it into these uh, government jobs and dead end programs? Well, we don't we don't see it in the commercial uh, in the commercial construction industry just yet. Some of these things might down the road lead to jobs, but right now jobs are what we need. Money loosening is what we need so that these jobs are released and the building starts up. We, now, we, need, we need answers right now, jobs right now. Now what about Ground Zero? I mean, I don't know about you, but I think it's a disgrace that we still have a hole in the ground. Wouldn't you think it'd be a good idea if they just took some of that top money that the banks are now paying mm -hmm. back and utilize some of those funds and uh, maybe, maybe implant it in the Ground Zero construction and get that project moving along? I mean, it's almost been 10 years now and we still got a crater that's just this mass grave of uh, Fellows like uh, yourself and I, and firemen and uh, policemen, all perished, in, and we still have this hole in the ground. Yeah, the, the, the problem is in, in New York City, there's a lot of red tape, and uh, they, they, they seem to think that, you know, they can always say, you know, there's, there's a lot of planning and everything else, but if they push the right buttons, did the right things, got these jobs started, uh, they, they, they could move that thing along very quickly. Do you, you think know? they could be doing more than they are right Absolutely. now? Absolutely. Absolutely. They, they, they should, with the economy being the way it is, and knowing that that work needs to be done. Would you, be. would you be on board with a campaign that wanted to build them back? Right now they're talking about uh, a campaign to bring the towers back to downtown. And it's called the Build Them Back campaign, where they want to reconstruct the towers, they want to start the economy. They feel like this project could be a huge catalyst to kind of uh, jumpstart, uh, especially in the New York economy. Oh, absolutely. Uh, if if you, you make enough noise out there, get the media involved, and, and get a, the right people involved, it's going to put a lot of uh, pressure on the right people, the politicians, to get the money released, to get this project underway. Manny, thank you very much. Right. Have a great holiday. You too.